left and start deliberating. So this is the portion of the show we like to call Stalling for Time. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to try to get the judges to know the time I need to deliberate. And normally this space would be filled by a, a German play put on by our AP German class. But unfortunately, due to scheduling issues, they can't do that this year. So what we're going to do is we're going to send all you guys out. And then uh, Rebecca and Josie are going to come out and I think sing something for us or do something for us. And then we'll just have like rotating, you know, little, small little acts, monologues, things like that until the judges come back. All right? <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Dwight Edwards. I am the representative of Stole and Fire Productions. Uh, I produce new, previously unproduced plays, and this is my 12th year supporting the new play festival at Aurora Grande High School. <laughs> to introduce uh, my fellow judges tonight, um, a, a freshman, first time here doing this, is uh, Wendy Marie Forster, and she went to PCPA. She also graduated from Marymount, I think. Um, see, she wrote it all down. Just like these guys that had to memorize a lot of lines in a very short period of time. She gave me this tonight, and so that's all I remember. No, not really. Um, she has directed, produced, and written plays that have been done in Europe, in Australia, in the United States. Uh, she is currently, she didn't write this down, but I know this anyway. She is currently the development director at San Luis Little Theater. And not the day after tomorrow, Friday, but the following Friday, she will be involved in her adaptation of Satra's No Exit, incredible play, uh, at San Luis Little Theater. Is that correct? All right. Anyway, <laughs> so let me introduce Wendy Marie Forster. I don't have a cheat sheet, so <laughs> it's thrown right to the wall, so I guess I'm going to get the prize, right? Yeah. Okay, that's how we do this. All right. You guys were amazing. Thank you. Thank I came last Thank you. Thank you. Um, as the newbie, I get to introduce third place to you. And the winner is... Oh, no, I think it's the, the author's name, not the play name, but I remember the play name. Our third place winner for this year is It's Too Late, Shelby Green. Woo! Another judge, this is a returning judge. This judge actually is I think he judged the first time was like oh, 10 years ago. And then he went off, I think he went to Israel. Uh, I knew him as the artistic director of Center Point Theater in San Luis Obispo. He is also the uh, an alumnus of this fine institution. He is a graduate of Aurora Grande High School. He got his New York University and uh, University of Iowa, I think. Maybe, kinda. Uh, he has um, he has worked in theater many different places. He is currently the artistic director, I think, something like that, or maybe the managing director. But I think it's artistic director of San Luis Obispo Little Theater. And next month, or the end of this month one of those times, he will be starring in that wonderful, delightful, very serious drama, the, the complete works of William Shakespeare, A Bridge. <laughs> so let me introduce you, Kevin Harris.
it's, it's really wonderful that Wayne's been doing this for, for 12 years. It's a remarkable thing to do. So thank you, Wayne. And thank you, everyone, for doing this. Since there are three people that are involved, we made it 150 so there's three separate checks, $50 each. Makes it easier to divide up. Um, and that was uh, terrific, but now we got first place. This is $200. Um, the name of the play is My World. And the playwright is David... Anthony Gator. Um, one last thing, and this is for all of you. I do want to thank you. I very much, my, my joy are the playwrights in theater. I like actors. I love the tech people. <laughs> Directors are okay too. <laughs> uh, playwrights, please don't run off. I do want to take a photograph of you for the website. And uh, again, congratulations. <laughs>